Hey folks, we're going to do two things here. We're going to go over an excellent example of space weather disruption to Earth's magnetic field, and then we're going to see how it relates to the cyclical disaster that is currently beginning to impact the entire solar system. We have gone over solar events like solar flares, the coronal mass ejections that amplify the solar wind, and the high-speed solar wind streams from coronal holes. But there is yet another element of this geo-effective space weather suite, the interplanetary magnetic field reversals. These are actual magnetic reversals of the solar wind electric field environment in which the planets orbit, and they happen fairly regularly. Every three to seven days we are hit by this reversal, and they cause minor geomagnetic disturbances, and actually account for about 15% of the more than a thousand scientific papers on solar climate forcing. Here is the solar wind data for today, as of around lunchtime in the United States. We are focused on the top right area here. The blue line jumps at the same time as the red and black lines in the top panel take a surge to higher magnitude. The blue line is the phi angle of the solar wind magnetic field, and as you can see, it is whipped 180 degrees. That is a full flip of the solar wind magnetic field environment. It caused a geomagnetic disruption at small scale, up in the top, the red and black lines, and as is usually the case, it carries a bit higher density, which can be seen below in the orangish yellow line, the rise in particle density. This is all caused by the passage of the sun's electric current sheets, the same structure we see in the lab, at other stars, and in galaxies, including our Milky Way. It carries the magnetic reversal point of the local environment, in this case, the solar wind electric field, and the sheet itself pushes particles along like a shovel does to snow, causing the extra density of particles. These are the key components of any current sheet system with a spinning sphere magnet in the middle. Crossing the sheet causes a localized magnetic reversal of the ambient environment while also bringing more particles. This is precisely what we have seen throughout the solar system as we are currently being impacted by the galactic current sheet. Every planet is experiencing changes of a magnetic nature due to the ambient environment magnetic reversal in progress. and. Those extra particles have been seen from the sun's atmosphere all the way out to the region beyond Pluto. If this is the first time you have conceptualized the current sheet in this way, whether at the sun or the Milky Way, go back now and re-watch the evidence video for the solar system shift leading into the current reset of the disaster cycle and the next age of Earth. You will see that evidence in a new way. The link is below, and I will see you in the morning for the daily show. Be safe, everyone.